there are so many priorities that a company needs to focus on, that the, the problems that a company needs to solve in order to scale up, but not all of the priorities are important at the same time. If you have an idea, how do you take that uh, to market? How do you make sure that uh, you reach uh, the, the impact that you want? A good idea can be absolutely excellent, but if uh, the venture that, that supports the, the idea cannot scale, the entire investment in the idea is not uh, going to have the impact that we want. In the very early stages, you need to get several basic things right. You need to have the right team. You need to play to your strengths and make sure that you have people around you that are also playing to their strengths, but they are complementing you. The other one is to establish the direction of your business, that you're not uh, picking up this kind of scatter gun approach where you're all over the place with what you're trying to do. The third aspect you need to get right is, does anybody care about what you're doing? Because if nobody cares, then there isn't really a root or support because you need to bring those people and resources with you um, to get where you want to go. The most difficult part of the journey, I'd say, is an all-encompassing kind of problem and that's ultimately leadership and it means a lot of things in the context that we're talking about right now it means the responsibility to determine where you're going how you're gonna get there and how do you build the right team and lead them to get there there's a lot of thinking that will go on that isn't shared within the team and so every once in a while, it's, it's, it's really, really important. In fact, it's essential that you step out of that and actually think high level. Okay, what, what is all the thinking that we've had over the past couple of months? And that may diverge from team members. So bringing people out of the office physically in a different location and actually enables, I think, a certain spark of creativity that otherwise wouldn't be there. And that creativity simply, I guess, connecting the dots of all the experience that people have had within the company into a common forum for that to be debated. Now, that discussion needs to be guided. There needs to be a framework to effectively manage that particular exchange of ideas. And that's where I think the, the, the program is so useful because then you synthesize that over a course of a couple of days or maybe just an hour, a couple of hours if it's just one team member that joins for a little bit. But doing that as you go, come back to the company, I think can really, really help to strengthen ideas or directions that we otherwise wouldn't have thought of. And, and, and that type of high level thinking, or I guess just strategic thinking, isn't done much by especially startups because you're, you're, you feel you're constantly battling against time. So naturally taking time off to think strategically feels almost counterintuitive. But the benefit of that is, cannot, cannot be understated.